FBI arrested an AIA DMK, the Tamil Nadu ruling party AIA DMK students wing functionary, along with two others in connection with the 2019 Pollachi sexual abuse case. The party, after much outrage, has expelled the student leader. His picture with AIA DMK minister SP Velubani has also raised eyebrows. The DMK has slammed the EPS government with Kanimori of the DMK saying allegations that the AIA DMK members were involved have now come true. The case pertains to 2019 where several women were sexually abused by a gang of five men who trapped them by befriend befriending them on social media. The women were later sexually assaulted, videographed and threatened. The five key accused are already in custody. They were arrested by the CBI in April 2019. The arrests were made on a complaint, based on a complaint of a woman who stated that the accused tried to sexually assault. People with uh, tainted uh, image, people who takes law into their hands, doesn't have any role in the party, doesn't find a place in the party. For, the, for your information, Arla Nandan, uh, membership is terminated and he is being thrown out of the party. Uh, so, AADMK is one party who doesn't entertain these kinds of behaviors from anybody for that matter in the organization. And it is this government which has sought the CBA inquiry into this case. Police under the chief minister in hmm. Tamil Nadu hmm. has become bad to worse. Hmm. And in this particular case, it was known even in February when this matter uh, surfaced, that the people in the high places have been involved in this matter. Mm -hmm. And uh, the AIDMK side, uh, the ministry level people try to shield it because uh, their wards were also have linkages and all those things. Mm -hmm. Had the case not been transferred to the CBI, they would have hushed up. And the Tamil Nadu police is becoming very, very usual for this kind of cover-up to the air. And several IPS officers, I accuse them, they don't behave up their IPS and they forget what kind of an oath they have taken when they pass out from their academy. Pramod Madhav, live with us from Chennai. Pramod, the Polachi case is fresh in people's memory even now. This is a big, uh, uh, you know, big uh, uh, action by the AIA DMK cracking down on the student leader, but the taint appears to be sticking with the DMK mounting a big attack and saying this establishes the ruling party's full involvement and complicity in this case. Absolutely. This is what Kanimori and M.K. Stalin have been saying since morning. In fact, M.K. Stalin is urging the CBI to go ahead, expedite the investigation and make sure that no matter who from AIDMK is involved, he's using these two words, that whoever from AIDMK is involved, they should be brought, like, you know, not one culprit should escape the clutches of the law. That's how he's trying to, like, you know, implicate it. In fact, the chief minister has retaliated toward this, but he could not provide a direct response. What for now AIDMK has done? is that uh, they have expelled uh, this person from uh, like the, any uh, membership from the party and the chief minister is only trying to say that in AIDMK, if such thing is found out, action would be taken immediately. But in DMK, only people with such activities become leaders. That seems to be the only rebuttal CM could provide on it. But this case is uh, like you know seriously fresh in the people, my, people's mind yes. because there were so much victims and so much horrific videos that got out at that point. Thanks, Pramod, for the latest on that story. Meanwhile, the National Investigation Agency has filed a charge.